Hail Wanderer. Laid before you is the bounty of history. Hi guys, this is Sliver here and I wanted to make this video really quickly because I wanted to comment on the new additions and especially the latest addition to the in-game store of Diablo 4. I feel like with the start of season 2 the game has greatly improved and one of the ways that it could be ruined would be something related to the cash shop. I don't think that this new skin will ruin the game, but I think it definitely is something worth thinking about. With the release of the new season, a new sorcerer outfit was added to the store and some people were already upset about that one. Here it is, still in the shop by the way, so you can buy it if you want. I'll be honest, I didn't and still don't have any problems with this one and I would side with those who defended the outfit. I agree with the argument that this is an R-rated game and this outfit fits a certain theme and the lore and all that. So I was okay with the introduction of the sorcerer outfit. However, I looked at the shop today and this is what greeted me. I mean, it's definitely a good looking outfit for rogues, but really? I feel like this is something that might be overdoing it a little bit. Does this one really fit the fantasy of a rogue or does it fit the dark and grim world that Sanctuary is supposed to be? I don't think so. I feel like this is, at best, a really desperate attempt for money from the part of Blizzard and at worst possibly crossing the border between the R rating and the over sexualization. Don't get me wrong. I know that many, many games have been doing this for money, but I don't really remember Blizzard ever crossing that line. Ok, there were a few examples with Overwatch, but those were more of accidents. However, this time, I believe with this skin, literally, Blizzard has crossed a new line that they haven't before, and this might be another indication of them being as profit-oriented as possible. So what do you think? Do you think this outfit is fine and there is nothing to talk about? Do you remember Blizzard ever releasing something like this? Let me know in the comments and see you guys next time.